Hello everyone, we are tracking some more snow in the forecast, but before that gets here, also dealing with some very, very cold temperatures overnight tonight. So the Billings area, I think even towards Bozeman, they're dealing with snow still, and snow continues to fall in those areas. Most of us are clear. In fact, it looks like we even have some sunshine off to the north, and we have seen a little bit of that in Great Falls today as well. Through the night tonight, that snow to our south is mostly going to fade away, but we see another wave start to push up towards us as we head into the day. And it's really as we head into the afternoon, late uh, morning to early afternoon hours that that really starts to get going. And that lasts into the late afternoon to early evening and then clears out by tomorrow night. So just another quick wave of snow moving through tomorrow. In general, most of us seeing between about an inch to three inches of accumulation at the most. Some places like Haver and Glasgow may not see anything more than a stray flurry. So definitely not as heavy as that last round of snow we were dealing with yesterday. It is going to be very cold, though. There's no doubt about that. We've got wind chill advisories and warnings in effect. Now, both of these are for the potential for wind chills as cold as 45 degrees below zero, especially in some of the colder spots like the valleys. Wind chill warning and wind chill advisory. The difference there, just the two different uh, National Weather Service offices in Great Falls and the one in Glasgow. So, the takeaway it's going to be very cold tonight. We're looking at low temperatures that are going to be in the teens to maybe even close to 20 below in some spots. A little bit of a warm-up for us on our Wednesday, at least above zero. And fortunately, not too much wind out there. We're looking at winds between about 5 to 10 miles per hour. So the winds aren't very strong. It's just the actual brutally cold air temperatures uh, that we're going to be have to having to deal with through the night tonight. Thanks for watching.